BJ Poor Game Gumbo, I've got my guest here, Dr. Steve Finn from Dr. Finn's Games, and we're talking about some of the spicy games he's got coming out on this big joint Kickstarter on August 24th. The next one up in line, The Butterfly Garden. I think you said a similar artist to Biblio's Quill and Parchment. Is that right? Uh, uh, identical artist, yes. Very, the, the same, that's the same. One and the same person. <laughs> that's right. So, so tell us about the game. What is Butterfly Garden? I, I'll just mention this right off the top. I'm changing the background color of that art on the on the box. It was just too much yellow. See, that's where you get an advanced copy and you're like, oh boy. So that's <laughs> going to be blue. Just so so if anyone's looking at it and saying, oh my God, there's so much freaking yellow. Uh, <laughs> I, the sky now is going to be blue. Okay. Um, and anyway, this and is there's the no you said until you get the PPC and you can look at it and go, oh wow, look at this. Yeah, I know. So um, Butterfly Garden is... A, this is the second edition. So I made a first edition a number of years ago, a very light and breezy set collection game where you are, again, simultaneous. There's some simultaneous decision making here where everybody plays a card for turn order. And the cards uh, have not only a like an initiative number, but they have a variety of butterflies on them. And what you're trying to do, kind of like Splendor-esque, you know, collect a set of things to earn the cards that are uh, displayed. At the top, you'll see tarot-sized cards. What, what you're doing is those are divided into four types. Uh, there's like an art museum, not an art museum. There's a natural history museum, a zoo, uh, a uh, whatever, I don't know. There's two other things. I'm blanking right now. I'm a little tired. And what, you're, what the theme is, you are saving butterflies from your local butterfly garden that's being... Uh, destroyed by uh, cr construction projects. And so you're saving them and then bringing them to another butterfly garden where they'll live happily, you know, forever after. Um, sure. And so it's basically, there's a balance that the real tension comes in in this game is you are, if you play a low initiative card number, you don't get to put as many butterfly car butterflies in your jar. Oh. And so if you go later, you'll get more butterflies. It's kind of like if you spend more time in the field, you'll get more butterflies, but you don't get to get to the place quick enough. Right. Um, so, you know, I've used that mechanic in, in like Sunset Over Water as well. Well, I guess this was first, and then I, I kind of reused it in Sunset Over Water, the general idea. You play a low card, and then you... But as you're collecting cards, you're also choosing cards based upon what butterflies, but also what initiative number they have so if i play a low initiative number i get to go now and i get to choose first again uh and do i pick another low card so i can keep going first or do but then i don't get a lot of butterflies that way or do i go and pick a, a you know a, a a later card and get more butterflies and you know there's some uh there's some special powers swap a card out from your jar um you can Someone is going to put a net out on the card. You can move someone else's net to get the card you want. You know, little things like that. But it's not, this is not a heavy game at all. Um, but again, I, I think it makes people think. And, you know, it's still got that, it's got my signature on it, you know. How long does it play? How long does it take? It's two to five players. And I would say, you know, I'd probably say seven minutes per player. <laughs> <laughs> Nina said uh, that you, you've got a picture of the new box on your Facebook page, maybe? I do. Yeah, she said she saw it. And yes, the blue sky looks a lot better. Yes. Any questions, Verla? Butterfly Garden? I'm looking forward to seeing those cards up close. That artwork looks fantastic. Yeah, if you, uh, yeah. Beautiful no, art there. Yeah, yeah. You, uh, on my Kickstarter video, uh, the intro video, I have a little panning shot that goes right up real close to them. You'll have to wait to see that. All right. Coming out August 24th, take a look for that Kickstarter. It's going to be in that all of the new 2021 releases for Dr. Finn's Games. And check it That's out right. August yes. 24th.